Hello again my friends, that elusive bastard Zur is back in the tower and this week all sorts of shenanigans are going down. Now from here on in, the exotic armor and weapons Zur sells each week will now be the new improved and upgraded version. So for example, even though I already have a fully upgraded Aklifar symbiote, I'm still going to buy this because as you can see, it now has a high defense allowing me to get closer to the new level 32 light cap. Now Zur is also selling for the first time Ruin Wings which are exotic titan gauntlets exclusive to the Dark Below DLC. If you don't have the DLC, you can't buy them. So then let's have a look at this armor's unique perks. As you can see, it has special weapon loader, increases the reload speed of all special weapons. It has impact induction, causing damage with a melee, reduces your grenade cooldown, and it has seeds of ruin. Heavy ammo drops more often and contains more ammo in each drop. Now this is gonna be really useful for Crota Zen, so Ruin Wings is a really good exotic to have. Zhu is also selling Void Fang Vestments. He's also selling Truth exotic shards and exotic engram so i'm going to go ahead and buy ruin wings uh booyah i'm also going to buy acleophar symbiote booyah and i'm also going to buy three exotic shards now Exotic shards are needed to unlock the full power of exotic gear and to exchange old exotics for new exotics as we're about to see in just a moment so i'm going to get three of these what uh it takes quite a while to actually get these so one two and of course three and I'm also going to buy an exotic engram that you see here now when you decode this engram there's now a chance for an exotic helmet from the dark below to drop if that is you've already purchased the dark below DLC now I really hope I get the ATS-8 Arachnid an exclusive dark below exotic helmet for the hunter its unique perk allows you to zoom in with the golden gun for maximum cross map carnage so after I'm done with Zure I'm going to visit the Cryptarch and pray that RNG Jesus is kind to me. So let me buy this as well. I'm going to acquire this. And uh, so now let's move on to the upgrade equipped exotics. Now every week you will have a random selection of exotic gear to sell. Now you can exchange your old exotics for these new upgraded exotics. And to do this you need an exotic shard, the correct amount of glimmer and of course the exotic weapon that you wish to exchange. But Beware my friends, all progress for the item you exchange will be reset. You have to start from scratch and upgrade it all over again. Yes, more effing grinding. So today I'm going to upgrade my Icebreaker and my Saurus Regime. So here we go. Now as you can see, the base level of damage for this Icebreaker is already higher than my old fully upgraded icebreaker and for me the icebreaker is one of the best if not the best exotic in the game so this is a no-brainer so I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade this as you can see it takes quite a while for you to do this so boom I now have an upgraded icebreaker and I'm gonna do exactly the same thing for Saurus Regime so let me just change some things around that will enable me to do that so let me just equip my Saurus regime and as you can see this is now available for me to upgrade so I'm going to go ahead and upgrade this too so I'll have Saurus regime which is for me the best exotic auto rifle in the game and Icebreaker which again is probably one of the best exotics in the game so I've got those now pretty excited about that so I'm now going to uh, have a look at the Urn of Sacrifice. You may be thinking, what the hell is this? It costs one strange coin. Um, so what you need to do is once you buy this, you hand this over to Eris, who then asks you to complete various quests. And at the end of which, you'll be given legendary level 31 gauntlets. Now, if like me, you already have legendary level 31 gauntlets, well, it's not exactly the most exciting thing to have to grind for. But by all accounts, they look cool. So I guess that's something. So let's also purchase this. Spending a hell of a lot of strange coins today. A gaboom. Um, actually, have I purchased this yet? Let me have a look. Did I actually already purchase that? Yes, I did. So there it is. So what I'm going to do now, as promised, is I'm going to go to the Cryptarch and decode that engram. So let's go. Uh, let's go and decode that exotic. Um, the helmet engram and let's hope that RNG Jesus is kind let's hope that I get that ATS-8 arachnid that would be effing amazing Cryptarch you bastard it's always tradition for me to salute the Cryptarch so here we go I'm gonna decode this exotic engram and hope to get something fucking cool here we go decode Apotheosis Veil. Fuck you, Cryptarch. That's the third time I've got that particular helmet. So not happy with that at all. Cryptarch, you bastard. So there you go, my friends. That is what uh, is going down Azure this week. 
Uh, let me know in the comments section what stuff you've bought. Uh, thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe for daily Destiny content. And as always, thanks for watching, you beautiful bastards. And we'll speak again soon, my friends.